jejunum and ileum are greatly coiled and occupy abdominal cavity below the stomach and liver. Small nodules of lymphatic tissue are located along the entire length of the intestine. At some places, these nodules are clustered in groups called pierced patches or lymph nodes. Function of small intestine. It completes digestion and absorbs digested food. Secrets hormones like secretin, enterogastrin, uterinin, and enterokinin and vilkinin and control the secretion of pancreatic juice, bile and intestinal juice. Next first part of the digestive system is called large intestine. Large intestine is wider than small intestine. It is about 1.5 to 1.8 meters long and 6 centimeter in diameter. It is looped outside the small intestine in the abdominal and pelvic cavities. It is divided into cecum, colon and rectum. Cecum and vermiform appendix. The opening of small intestine into cecum is controlled by an iloxacal valve which permits the food to move into the large intestine but not back into the small intestine. From cecum arises a worm like blind tube, the vermiform appendix. It is 8 to 10 cm long. In man, it has no function. For this, it is called vestigial organ. Sometimes, mucus lining of appendix gets inflamed, causing pain and discomfort. This condition is called appendicitis. Next part of the large intestine is called colon. It is an inverted two-separate tube divided into four parts, namely ascending colon, transverse colon, descending colon, and the sigmoid colon. The colon has three muscular longitudinal band, bands, the tenacial poly and small which is called posteria. Next part of the large intestine or the last part is called rectum. It follows the colon. It is about 20 cm long tube that terminates into a 2.5 cm long anal canal that opens to the exterior by anus. Anus is guarded by two sphincters internal and external. The internal anal sphincter is formed of stomach muscles and external anal sphincter has voluntary or striped muscle. Function of large intestine. Absorb of water from food and secretion of mucus. Digestion of undigested waste matter. 